Oh, he is really striking in the early part Let's of the round. Go, no way, I got bro. Dude, he's only gonna say you heard. You see that? You see that? Bro, he got from the, the fairway. Nota, this oh, is bro. second. It's about 137 yards to the front, 157 to the hole, pin sitting on the Let's right. Let's go. No way, no way, no way, no way, no way. <gasps> well, I don't have my tape measure out, but that looks like oh, what, six, seven feet in there, but that is an excellent approach shot. Around. Coming off the eagle, this for birdie. Birdie to move to four under now on the day. And now our first par three of the day, the fifth. So good mix park. of holes to start the round. You see the yes. ocean on the left, and, and the green looks like tiny <laughs> sitting next to that Caribbean. It is a really small target here. This is an excellent challenge. Maybe this would be good. <clears throat> no! Uh -oh. Yeah, not sure if that was a miss hit or just a miscalculation, but that comes up well short and is into the hazard. Okay, so now after the drop and the penalty stroke, this will become his third shot now at the par three. I don't know what this means, I don't really care. No! How? I do not like this map at all, dude. Alright, don't, don't play it. And that is another shot into the water. And rather than trying again, it might be time to admit defeat here and move on to the next hole. What do you think? Oh, I get, I didn't yeah, this is where the golf course really opens up and you can feel the breadth of the beauty of where you are. Teeth of the dog on the coastline of the Dominican Republic. This sixth hole is a good par four. It's around 500 yards. This is what I need last game. Let's go. Yes, sir. Doesn't hurt to leave it short when you do that. Well done. That is a birdie from off the green. You know, part three like this, the seventh, when you stand on the tee box, first thing you want to do is just look around and appreciate exactly where you are because there aren't many places like it in the world. The next thing you want to do 
He is focused on the task at hand. And this one, it's a challenge. Yeah, that one came in a little hot. It's safely on, but it'll be a long look coming up. We welcome in Iona Steven. This, a putt for birdie. There is a sneaky bit of break from left to right no. on this putt. Don't overdo it. Mm, yeah, that's no. a pretty good putt. Just a little bit off the mark. Good concentration there. That's a distance where a putt could get away, but that, in for a par. Visual hits just keep coming, don't they? Now to the eight. This par four is just over 400 yards. Breathtaking tee shot over the Caribbean. Trying to work its way back in. Beautiful tempo to that swing, and this is going to wind up squarely in the fairway. This is why you practice these shots from under 100 yards. You've bombed your drive. Now it's time for the touch shot. Zip one in there close. No! Of course it will man. Digs into the bunker, getting set to play the third shot. Oh, that was so cool. Yeah, look how quick that was. Very difficult to get that to stop, even out of the sand. And that race is right on by. So the short mess. Are you? Mm. Those are painful. Are. Okay, so not what he was looking to do once he got on the green. That's the Cobra, a three putt six here at the par four. Well, right about now, after the holes you just played, you're saying, wow, that was something to see. You're going to feel even better if you can walk off this challenging par 5 ninth, about 600 yards, with a birdie or eagle. I have to win this one. My last redemption. Let's go. No more sand. Get out of here, sand. No one cares. It's so hard to bounce back after a huge score, especially when you're still reeling from it. But try and pull the screws back, back in the head there. Just take a little breath, maybe two. Decent swing. Don't try and kill it exactly like that. Really good shot. I guess you could say slow and steady is going to win you this race, or so he yeah. hopes. Long ways to go. I'd also add the word short, to Rich. Slow, steady, and short. This is a long par five now. Oh, yes, 
great touch, getting that 60-degree wedge underneath the ball, and that goes into the hole for a welcome birdie. Now, as we begin this second nine, you can put the phone away. You're not going to be snapping as many pictures, at least for the first few holes. Doesn't mean it isn't challenging. It's plenty. We're going to head inland, first few holes on this backside, starting with a relatively easy par four. The tenth is about 400 yards. Oh, my word. Yeah, that's oh. a nice swing, and the result is going to be a tee shot that is set up just fine. So the great tee shot left him here. Now his second from relatively close range. Let's go. Dip 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 dip. You heard me once, you heard me first. Now this, for birdie at 10. And this is pretty flat all the way. I don't think there's much in it at all. Mm, got it, bro. Why the pop pop don't play me like that, bro? The pop pop don't eat shit, bro. You heard me, bro. Bro, the pop pop ain't shit, bro. I've been pop pop for years, bro. You heard me. God damn, bro. These pop. Thank you. Okay, probably was well played, a right? from this hole after the big drive, but Jolly he does shame. walk away with a par. Not a ton of nuance here at this uh, hey, almost a 600 right? yard I mean, par five. In fact, the second in the last sorry. three holes. This just blast away here. Two good pokes, and you'll have a GG boss. Cheat the dog. Cheat the doge.